grab your nuts and bark. So I'm gonna try to make a long story real short. Okay, so 2020, me and my Her voice is kind of deep, with like a hint of helium. It's kind of weird. It's... This one's going through like a little split splash, you know, like disagreements or whatever. The end was near it. We both knew it. So I went ahead and moved on. Seriously, I'm gonna let it continue. Pardon my interruption. But she sounded like a gay man, right? Like, if you just close your eyes, that sounds like a gay man. So called black man. Well, move back. Me and my ex started fooling around. I ain't gonna be getting pregnant. Okay, so when I slip around my ex, I told my husband, you know, I never kept it a secret. Like, hey, I slept with such and such. And so when I got pregnant, it wasn't a surprise to who I was pregnant by. So, he. To you, bitch. He was all like, okay, hey, um, we gonna think about it or whatever. I was like, okay, well, I'm gonna let you know now. If you wanna do that get back stuff, you could go right now. Cause I really ain't got time for that. I was just real peaceful during my pregnancy. I was, I was trying to deal with no bull crap. And so he was like, "Okay, I want to have my family. I don't, don't want to um leave. I want this and it." Sucker! He tried. He kept on trying to get get back still. And not no, I'm pointing get back. I'm pointing get back. So she sound like Ebony K. Williams. Is she? A few months down the line, he moved out. He moved back about a month before Thanksgiving. But Thanksgiving came around. And he was just like, he was out for a week from work, and I was in the boys. So he was like, hey, I'm going to go through with my mama for on Monday. You and the baby can come down Wednesday. Well, you know, we spent Thanksgiving down there. He's not a family-oriented guy, so that was the first red flag. Like, oh, you want to go? Yeah, we both are work. I ain't got nothing to do. You want to go? We can hear this time. Okay, go ahead. I didn't say nothing about it because whatever you finna think you finna do, I'm gonna show you something. <laughs> All right, so boom. He left my That's their problem. See, they're always trying to outthink and think men are doing what they doing. She said, whatever you trying to do, it ain't gonna work out. I thought it was about communication. I'm, I'm sorry. God damn. Monday, Susan. It's hard to not talk when you hear this. They calm. He didn't call me or nothing. Oh, he called me around 11 o'clock one time. And when he called me, he was cleaning out his car. For real. Quick, just please. <laughs> Close your eyes. Just for <laughs> 15 seconds. And tell me, does that sound like an organic woman? Or or a trans uh, woman? He got an old school 86 cutlass. I'm going to put a picture in here. <laughs> All right, so that's the car. Real nice. He kept it clean. It was never dirty. Never. So, I realized right now, I'm like, dang, I ain't talked to Q today. But then it hit me. Oh, I talked. Talk story ain't funny, but I did what I told y'all to do. That sounds like a gay nigga named Demetrius. I knew in the setting. You know how they all around some shit. Man, of course you gonna run into some at the workplace and everything. She sound like Demetrius, nigga. Something I'm on earlier today. But he was feeling like his car. You know, he ain't hitting back up, checked on me and the boys or nothing. So I been went and got my mama phone because before he left, I shared his location with my mama phone because him and my mama don't text and I ain't wanted to say, you know, share your location when you go to the message. And so I was going to check you. I see him riding around the web. So I text him. I was like, hey, is everything okay? He ain't text me back. So I text him again. I was like, hey, you good? All right, he ain't text me. So I started calling him, y'all. I called him about three times. Every time I called him, the phone or in list and list. So I was like, okay. So I texted him again. I was like, you really think you slick when I come up there Thursday? I'm going to show you some, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, 
Why does my answer if I miss stuff? It's okay, you can tell I missed stuff. The location was still thinking. So I got my mama phone and I- Yo, it's so ghetto here now, bro. I swear, bro. This whole- Yeah, man. Y'all need to check out that boy, Will. Got pregnant with the ex. The husband was entertaining the idea of getting back work. Sucker! Sharing his location with his mom, which I didn't even know that was a thing. So guys, be safe out there.